All right, guys, here today we have a 2010 Chevrolet Silverado 1500. Uh, this is a crew cab 4x4, um, and it has the 4.8 V8 in it, um, which does not have the uh, fuel management system in it. Uh, if you're aware of the trucks with the 5.3s that have the active fuel management issues, uh, this one has the 4.8 and does not have that system. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and start a walk around video here. Um, looks like it has near new tires on it. Um, these are Thunder Ranger ATs. Um, they look near brand new um, all the way around there. And I believe those are 17 inch. Yeah, 17 inch. And those are actually a LT light truck tire rated for up to 80 PSI. So really heavy tires on there. Uh, looks like somebody's added some LED lights here on the front. And we've got some rock chips here on the front nose. You see that there on the hood. A little scuff there on the front corner. Looks like there's just a little chip right there in the glass. Rocker panels. A little dirty, but don't seem uh, too rusted out there. Seem pretty solid, a lot of these. This is where they start rusting on these Chevrolets. And you can see right there, get the light right. Got a little bit of, uh, looks like there was a dent that somebody pulled back out right there. There's a little wrinkle there behind the four wheel drive uh, sticker. A little wrinkle there. It's got the two inch reese hitch here. And it looks like we've got the light hookups there. This is a short bed. Looks like it's got a uh, roll-in bed liner. And same thing here on this side. We've got some more wrinkles here on this rear corner here. Some scratches. Some other small scratches here on the side of the bed. And we got a thing right there. Another spot right here over the glass. Looks like there's a little spot there. The paint's starting to crack there a little bit. Let's go ahead and take a look on the inside here. Cloth interior. Looks like a charcoal. A little tear right there when you slide in. Another little small spot right there. Seat six, that console folds up. You can see another one there in the middle. Power windows and locks, mirrors. Let's go ahead and start it up here. Hundred seventy-five thousand four hundred eleven miles. So I believe we put between seventy-five and one hundred miles on this truck ourselves. Seems to run and drive nice. Uh, you can see there's no check engine light on, airbag light, ABS. Uh, that one blinking is just my seat belt light right there, but the dash is all clear, service lights there. AM, FM, CD player, auxiliary input, 
Um, also have OnStar capable here. Couple power outlets. This does have the uh, four wheel drive on the floor, they call it. Um, less electronics involved. Um, but yeah, shipped on the fly, four wheel drive on the floor. Let's take a peek in the back seat and under the hood. Back seats are in good shape. Looks like there's a, a tear right there on the back of that vinyl, that console right there. And let's peek under the hood. You can see 4.8 on the uh, engine tag right there. Engine sounds good, runs good. Um, engine's dry underneath, got underneath there. Uh, we gave it an oil change. Um, engine transmission underneath, uh, nice and dry. Uh, for more information, you can uh, give us a call or visit us online at heritagemotorsales.com.